Parts of Spokane will soon be up for sale. The city intends to sell a number of properties to make money. And KXY 4's Ian Cole joins us now live from Riverfront Park, which is one piece of prized property that will not be for sale. Ian? <laughs> Right, Nadine. A uh, city spokesperson says that none of the parks, even Riverfront Park, even though it's prime real estate, will not be up for sale. There is some prime real estate, however, in this area that they own and do intend to sell. Uh, tend to sell. You can start with Anthony's just across the river. Out of the 9,000 acres it owns, the city of Spokane hopes to sell about 100 acres this year. One of the more notable properties is Anthony's restaurant and the property surrounding it. And so we're looking at how we can get those back into the, the private sector and get them to be um, you know, more functioning properties for the community. The city could also relocate some of its services to help sell property, like the water and wastewater buildings along Hamilton and North Foothills. That land could be used for businesses, attracting sales and property tax. Which is a good thing, too, to get that back into private ownership, back into, onto the tax rolls. Most of the 100 acres going up for sale are just slivers of land next to homes similar to this one. And we have to buy sometimes more than we need to do the street project in, in the right-of-way purchase. But now you don't need them anymore. But now the project's done and we don't need them anymore. And the money raised cannot be used for city's operations or services. Instead, it will go back into capital projects and help improve sites like the streets department. The city hopes people will now actually want to buy those properties. Great for development or even just use by adjacent property owners um, that we really don't have a use for, but they might. The city is also eliminating its real estate uh, department. Two full-time employees and a temporary employee will be let go next month. Also, if they do need help with real estate matters, they will hire a private realtor to work as a consultant. Reporting live in Riverfront Park, Ian Cole, KXOY4 HG News.